channel. My name is Carolina and today we will be making quadrant. I know everyone is hopefully staying at home and you might be wondering, hmm, what can I do with my family while we're just chilling at home? Well, you can make quadrant. First, you'll need a mom. Hi, everybody. And then you'll need a dad. Hello. And last but not least, you will also need a dog. This is Daisy. Let's, Let's begin. begin. In order to make this quadrant, you actually need very minimal ingredients, as you can tell. The ingredients are all laid out right here in front of us, but you will need yeast. First, you have your flour, then you pour in your yeast. Next, pour in your warm water. Then we're going to stir it together. This will make the dough. And then you're going to knead it. Once you knead it and it's a bowl, you're going to let it rest for 15 minutes. Once you let the dough rest for 15 minutes, now you're going to knead it for 3 minutes. We're going to pour in the 1 tablespoon of oil into the bowl. This is to prevent it from sticking while it's rising. And you're just going to roll it around in here. You're not kneading it in. We're going to let it rest for 1.5 hours. But one of the many things that you can be doing here at home with your family is telling hopefully good jokes to each other. Dad, you're up. 洗手液給那個小貓、小狗、小豬洗手,誰最害怕? Oh yeah! <笑> you can even pet your dog or your pet, as long as it's not a fish. You can even start dancing with your family. While we wait for the dough to proof, we will chop these green onions. To be honest, I'm not very good at chopping, but that's the beauty of this recipe. The onions will be hidden inside the dough. There's that for you. Ta-da! Then you're going to put in 20 grams of oil and 1 teaspoon of salt. Going to mix that together. This is your oil, green onion, and salt mixture. Put it aside, and we get our one and a half hour proof dough, and we punch it. <laughs> Benefits, you can get your family to take turns punching it. Dough looks great. It's so spongy, and it's just so much fun to play with right now. I'm going to roll this dough flat, and then let it rest for another 15 minutes. I'm going to roll this into a nice rectangular strip. And this is because we're going to roll it up later. Spread your green onion mixture on it. Spread it lightly though. You're going to fold the bottom until it meets the middle. And then you're going to fold one more time until it reaches the top. Another one. Slightly flatter one. Karate chop time. Flip it over, stretch it out, take your chopstick and halfway mark, twist twice, like that, then press it down and pull your chopstick out. These are my quadrants. Some of them died, but they look generally okay. Now we're just going to let it proof for another hour. We finished proofing these for another hour. So they clearly expanded. Wow. So now let's start steaming these because I honestly cannot wait to eat them. Thank you, Vo, for your help. Now You're we're welcome. Gonna eat it. Wait to see it. That's very good. Oh, smell good. Very good. Delicious. Jose. Would recommend making this. It's just really time consuming. And remember to stay home, stay safe, and, and stay.